Hi, I'm Gabby and I'm going to show you how to make this really fun craft for session four. So the materials that you'll need, first of all, from your supply box, all these papers should be clipped together. So there's some papers that go from smaller to larger and they're in rainbow order. And there's some white papers that have things printed on it. So you'll need those and also from your supply box, you'll need this little ring clip that we'll use later. And then from home, you have to go get some scissors, glue, a hole puncher, and some things to color with. So I'm using crayons. So the first step that we're going to do is we're gonna take these white papers that were clipped together. And as you can see, there's boxes outlined on each of the pages. So then some of these um, papers have two boxes and some have one. So we're gonna cut along these black lines and then you'll have six boxes. So when you finish cutting out all the boxes, as you can see, they go from smaller to larger, just like the other rainbow papers. We're gonna get back to that in a second. You can also see on the bottom of each one, it says something. So here it says my home, my city, my state, my country, my continent, and my world. So on each of these boxes, you're gonna draw what it describes. So here you can draw your house. For my city, you can draw a town or wherever you live, something that reminds you of your city. And then here for my state, this is the state of Pennsylvania, which is the state that we live in. So you can draw a pattern, color it in, or you can draw something that reminds you of Pennsylvania. And then here we have my country. So this is the United States of America, which is where we live. So Pennsylvania is somewhere over here. And you can color this in or again, draw a pattern or something that reminds you of our country. And then this is my continent. So there are seven continents in the world. And this is North America. So this is the United States here. It's in North America. So you can also color this in. And then finally, we have my world. So you could draw the earth or maybe even space. And then when you're coloring, done coloring all these things, we can go to the next step. All right, so I just finished drawing on all of these. I'm gonna show you what I drew so maybe you can get some ideas. So for my home, I just drew my house or a house. And then for my city, I drew a bunch of houses, some bigger buildings in the church. For my state, I just drew a fun design that I picked out some colors that I liked and just drew some squiggles. And then for my country, I drew the flag on our country. And then for my continent, I just used some fun colors and colored in. Some of them are just countries and some of them I just drew a block of countries in the same color. And then lastly, for my world, I drew the earth, the sun, the moon, and this is space here and there's some stars in the distance. So now for the next step, you're gonna take from smallest to largest, you can see with the rainbow color paper um, that there are some smaller papers and there are some bigger papers. So you're gonna take the smallest of the white papers that you drew on and match it with the smallest colored paper. So you're gonna do that for all of them. So they should all match up the sizes then. So you can put them all together. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna take your glue stick or tape or whatever you have with you. You're gonna glue that towards the middle of it. Okay, so when you finish gluing them all on, they should be like this. Here we all have the bigger pieces matching together and smaller pieces together so now lastly we're gonna put them in size and rainbow order so the smallest in the front and then like this so and then the biggest will be in the back so you're gonna order them like that so now make sure they're all lined up on the top and they they go to the middle and that you can see the words for each one and you're gonna take your hair puncher and punch it right here up at the top in the middle.
And then after you start to put a hole punch in it so that you can see where it goes, you might have to punch each of the papers individually like that. So once you've gotten the hole puncher through all of the papers and you can see there's a hole there, it goes all the way through, you can take your ring and open it up and put it through and clip it again. And then you have all of these on a flip book. So then you can flip through them and look. Like that. So we can start by showing compassion in our home, but we have to remember that we have to show our compassion to everyone in our city, our state, our country, our continent, and in the whole entire world. So we wanna make sure we show compassion to everyone in our world.